Hello, and welcome to Xenoblade Chronicles 3. My name is Maybe Dennis, and yeah, we're gonna start this game today. Bought it on launch, and uh, to be completely honest, I actually don't have much Xenoblade playing experience. I've watched a Let's Play of the first two games, and although I think the second one was a little bit anime at some times, the story for both of them were seemed like really good, and uh, I've always wanted to try one out myself, and this was the prime opportunity. And, uh, yeah, I, I've i seen a lot of good things about this. I actually, because I wasn't actually planning on playing this game until literally the day of release where I suddenly felt like picking it up, I haven't actually been following the game's uh, pre-release up until now. So uh, I only know like the basic story stuff, like there are two factions and they were fighting against each other or something. I've seen some character designs. I've seen some no pawns, but other than that, I'm, you know, this game is new. I'm going in pretty much blind, and I wonder how well it connects with Xenoblade 1 and 2, but I look forward to exploring that. So, let's head in. It's version 1.10 now. Guess there was an update before I started playing the game, but let's head in. Game has been updated, version 1.10. Uh, let's see... Nah, I don't really care. Actually... So it's just for DLC. DLC Volume 1 is available for download. And, uh... Added support for the expansion pass and other stuff. Cool. Uh, I don't know much about this game. I hope you can change the difficulty at any time. But because it's my first time playing, uh, like Bravely Default 2, I'll probably start on normal. And anytime? Yeah, cool. Thanks for answering my questions, Xenoblade. Thanks, Nintendo. Oh no. Okay, the screen tear is fixed. Queen's anniversary is gonna start without us, guys. Yeah, move your feet. Hop, hop, run like you mean it. <sighs> Slow down, guys. Oh, they got like the. Is it true though? <sighs> There's gonna be fireworks. The winged-haired people. Yeah, saw them setting up yesterday. And the no there bond. were loads of them. It'll be worth it, promise. That looks like the main character, the one with the ponytail. Uh oh, oh no 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 There's gonna be explosions, oh no. The world? I wonder if time is actually stopped or if it's just his imagination. Oh, what the heck is that? Wait, is this connected to Xenoblade? One, I don't really have too many memories of Xenoblade One. It's been a long time ago. Oh, I'm so confused. Whoa, he's gone. Oh. No. Nice. 
the Mekonis. Two colossal martial nations locked in war. Kevez and Agnes. What is it they need to stay alive? Water? Food? Certainly. Oh, whoa, whoa, what's happening to that dude? He just fossilized? What we need most is life itself. Taking each other's lives. With the taken flames becoming your own in turn. While the other, the one whose essence is stolen, leaves only a husk. So that thing is literally sucking the life force out of people. There's that red dude on standing on top of the robot. Over there. What are you playing at? How can we claim their life if you blow up the whole sparking thing? Cripple them! Aim lower! Y yes, sir! Lower and aim, sir! At the crotch. Nice shot! Design really reminded me of the Mechanis. Fighting in order to live and living to fight. That's the way of our world, Ionios. Cruel irony that it should mean eternity. Because slowly but surely, our world is now dying. Hey, that's us. Even though. We have yet to realize that. That a Monado. Or a blade. That looks like a lot like the Monado. Worry about yourself, Noah. There's still more of them. Even so. Shut it. Stop flapping your gums and move. Yeah. We've got more incoming. All right, right into the thick of things. Uh, how do I play? How do I roll? All right, auto attack. You will automatically attack an enemy if you approach them. This is called an auto attack. Stand near an enemy to continue auto attacking. The icon confirming you're in the range for auto attacks will be shown in the bottom right corner of the screen. Okay. Auto attack while I move. No, I cannot. Stop. All right, I got one. He is. My friend here is tanking. He's not gonna live to make it through this, is he? Hey. Destinations! Uh, blah! Mar will be marked- will mark your next destination. Number below, it indicates how far away you are from the destination. Okay. Browsing tips. You can review tips that you- that have popped up in the game at any time from the main menu. System. Tips. Okay, destination is this way. How to begin a battle. Begin a battle by drawing your weapon. First, target an enemy. Then press A to draw your weapon. 
to withdraw from battle, hold A uh, for a while to sheathe your weapon. Approach an enemy to automatically target them. If there are multiple enemies, press L or R to target a different enemy. Roger that. Oh. Which button was it again? A. Oh, so we have Noah, Uni, Lance, and Wamba. Oh, look at Lance's HP. He's tanky. So it seems like we got attacker, healer, tank, and another attacker. In that case. Wamba's not gonna make it. We can't have two of you here. Arts. Arts are stronger than auto attacks. They can be activated by pressing X, B, or Y. After using the art, you cannot use it again until its gauge fills back up. The art's gauge will fill up automatically over time. It's called recharging. Okay. Here we go. Oh ho ho! Can you just spam them as long as they're off the land? Alright, I don't know what they do though. That was good damage. Yeah. The AoE is coming up. Coming up. Cowabunga! Come on, keep going. One battle. When's the battle happen? Stick the mud as in. They're tough. And here I thought, oh no, we got to fight back. Time to draw weapons. Come here, I got something for you. Thanks. Back attack would probably does more damage than the back. That was one on one. Alright, great. Oh, he's toppled. I don't know what that means, but he's toppled. Oh, dang. Let's see a back attack from the front. Okay, that was half the damage. The back attack is better from the back. Yep, a hundred. Side break. Guarding the artillery. They're not going anywhere. Anyone's moving right now, it's us. What are we gonna do? I don't even know why I'm here. Let's go! If the front line breaks, we're all dead. But the position! We can handle this ourselves. Go on, move it! Oh, are we on the black team? The one that was absorbing the life force of all the other. Actually, I guess maybe both of them were. I can't tell what's happening. Oh, that one soldier might be important. Specifically nodded at, nodded at us. Whoa! That's what's hitting us! Well, now we know. It's do or die, Noah! Got it! You Lula. Okay. Talent arts. Talent arts are stronger than normal arts. A talent art can be activated by pressing A once the circular gauge is full. What's it? Oh, just that. Talent art. Yeah. A talent arts gauge is recharged by performing actions expected of a character's role, also call, called role actions. Cool. Uh. 
If you meet the requirements for an, for arts that give bonus effects for your positioning, your talent art icon will flash red, and your talent art gauge will charge up a lot. Actions deal uh, that deal damage effectively, such as dealing critical hits or participating in combos, also count as roll actions, charging your talent gauge bit by bit. Cancel an attack. Performing an attack, uh, uh, performing an attack the moment previous one hits allows you to cancel one attack into the next, making them flow quickly into each other. You can cancel auto attacks into arts and arts into talent arts. Auto attack into arts. arts. Doing this speeds up the execution, letting you deal more damage quickly. Ooh, okay, nice. Uh, in that case, we're good to go. Alright, cut up. Fox Slosh! Okay. Oh, that, this giant thing is down. Fox Slosh! Woo! Oh, that was really nice. Oh, what's coming up? I wonder if you can switch between party numbers. Oh, he's down again. Hey, that was a nice combo. Oh god! What's that? And we're, we're golden. Almost. No one's dying. Alright. Nice. Win the battle. That looked like we shot them with guns and none of us have. Oh, wait, no. One of us have a gun. Big robot in the background. And lots of dead people. Oh, the horns, uh, the, the helmets have holes for the, the wings for that race of people. This war is brutal. That white robot down for the count. Whoa, whoa. I don't know if we're the goodies or the baddies. Oh, none of our friends died. Yeah. We won. Your lives are ours. Do they live longer if they suck the life force out of other people? So they're that's like literally what they're doing. Or is it just a normal victory chant? I can't tell. Nice looking building. She looks evil. <laughs> I 
Not concerning at all. Probably pods that hold humans. Oh. I, I don't think people grow that fast. Hey, that fetus grew up instantly. Imagine being born Everyone 10 years old. Is born looking like this. As soldiers. As weapons for slaying Agnians. Yes. All of us live only to fight. Whoa. Cut that out! Stupid Noah! This is like the type of training where you could literally die. <laughs> nice one, Lance. Too early for that. Look, it's you they're after here. Just take out their attackers and we're golden. They're gonna get it handed to them. <sighs> Flickering hoop. You're as slippery as Noah sometimes. Uni. Shit never shuts up. Kite. Range darts. Easy. Oh, wait. That guy was the person that was commanding and was talking about... I forgot. His eye was glowing and he was talking on a communicator when we were on the battlefield. <sighs> She was gonna get bonked. You okay? Uni. Cheers for that. You're a lifesaver, Yorin. Yorin. Sparking dead weight. Hey! Change of plan. Kite! You keep firing and don't stop. Oh, uh, what? Whatever you want. Huh? Go ballistic. Just draw their attention. Because what we're after here is that lame duck. Yorin? But he's bottom of the class. Why bother? Thing is, the brat's still a decent healer. Get it? Ah, right. So we're playing by the book here. Pisses me off. But the fight will be good as one. Yeah! yeah. School cool project like this. Calling it Noah's gonna the usual formation. And I'll play them. Wait, what? <gasps> We're snuffed. Kai's just a decoy, so they're really after. Oh. Quick thinking, Lance. Running. 
But we didn't see that guy in the future. So cheeky. <laughs> Get off me! Had to go and play the hero, didn't he? You really think you could have taken them? <sighs> I think Yorin did the right thing. If he hadn't used his powers back there, You'd have been first out of the running. Yeah, but still. Didn't have to go get himself killed for it. Come on. He was trying to protect you. He lured in Garvel's gang. Gave us a chance to turn it around. Ugh. You know who wasn't up to it? We weren't. Yeah, but... Just stop it! No more arguing. It's my fault. I should have just done a better job then we'd have won hey <laughs> so much for getting to the final huh sorry I let us down on your big day I'm so sorry what big day the birthday what whose yours dummy it's your second term, right? Remember? <laughs> oh. What's a birthday? A win would have been a nice surprise. Lance was pretty fired up too, weren't you? Cut it out. Hey. Oh, this is a nice group. What? You'll apologize, right? Might do, might not. Screw you. We each have a lifespan of 10 years. 10 years? In terms, life begins with our first term and ends at the close of our 10th. And over the course of those 10 years, we fight continually. Though in reality, there aren't that many who can hold their flame for the whole 10 years. Most lose their lives on the battlefield before they reach year 10. But those who do survive to the end. are honored in a special service. We call it the homecoming. This sounds messed up. Morning, Yorn. Hey, Noah. Morning. Morning, uh, Lance. Hmm. Barker. Get a move on. Quick, we're gonna miss the homecoming. So, theoretically, right now, First one they've ever they are here, right? one year old. Yeah. Isn't it awesome? <laughs> this is beginning his second term, which means only one year has passed. Dang. Yeah, they they look like they're ten. <laughs> Is this someone who reached age 20? <laughs> or technically age 10? I think that's what they said homecoming was. God, she looks so evil. Whoa! Even the queen's come out! So that's her majesty, huh? Wow! I've never seen her before! Oh. 
<laughs> and I was like, eh. They have a mark on their hand. Probably to indicate the number of terms, if I had to guess. Oh no, what what's happening? What's happening to her? Why is she glowing? Oh, okay, she's dying. <laughs> okay, homecoming is when they reach that age. So cool! I heard the stories, but this is just wild. That's gonna be me someday. Just you try and stop me. You guys too. You're totally making it with me. Of course. Uh, hmm. And you, Noah, right? Huh? Sure. Yeah, you bet. Our lives came from the Queen. And we all lived for a chance to take part in the homecoming. The chance to return to the Queen's embrace. Carrying out ten years of service, fighting. That was our whole world. This is Nobody really, to question it. really sus. Until that day. Hey, that's me. Wonder how old Noah is now. Noah, Uni, Lands, Yorin. I think you. I think it was Yorin. Back to the present. So just using the life energy of all the dead soldiers from war to essentially recycle. Dang, that just, they just crushed the bodies. I guess they're kind of artificial here. Or like... Artificial, not the right word, but... Manufactured humans. This is really... Interesting. But also kind of unsettling. Who did that? Do you have to? Huh? You shouldn't be sending those guys off like that. What? Why not? Why are you like this, Noah? It's Agnes, our enemy. Well, yeah. They don't have an officer, though, to send them. Yeah, they all bit the dust thanks to us. So what? Look, there's no rule not to. Then what, you're just gonna keep going? I don't get you, Noah. I know we're putting our lives on the line, but still. Yeah, yeah, we get it already. Friend or foe, someone has to lay them to rest. For that is my role as an officer. Right. Uh, is my voice that deep? Shot at you. I wasn't trying to be anyone specific. Right. I've had about enough of all this depressing crap. Let's head back and hit the showers. I'm all gunked up with blood and sweat. Ah, oh, bye, transport. Guess we missed it again. Ah. Uh, <laughs> now we have to walk oh, through all the dead bodies. Noah always does this. How many times is it we've had to walk home now? It's like the sixth time. Don't worry.
Damn, that was a. This is a really strong intro. I. I kind of hard to swallow. Okay, I thought something was gonna appear in the foreground and like scare me. Atia region. Atia region? Ever blight plain. Landmarks. Landmark discovered. Torchlight hill. Plus 5 EXP. There are places across the world that will give you EXP once found. Key locations are called landmarks. And especially difficult to find ones are called secret areas. When the whole party has been incapacitated in battle, you will return to the last landmark you passed by. Better not miss the terrain data. Okay, Torchlight Hill. Minimap. The minimap is displayed at the top right of the screen. It displays the character's immediate surroundings and quest destinations. Press R or the Press that thing to display a bigger map. Press Z L and Y. Let me take a look. That whenever you need to navigational assistance. Doing so will display the shortest route to your destination. Be advised, however, that the shortest route may sometimes take you past tough enemies, so it's not necessarily the best or easiest one. Try various routes for the best effect. All right, let's head back to Colony Nine. All right, let's try that. Yoink! Oh, dang, that's cool. You can see a trail. All right, and here's the map. Bigger. Cool. Oh. Menu. Oh, do you hear that music? With all the stuff we learned. Combat. Lands is class. Class. Healer. Defender. Attacker. Uh, giving up when in battle you can hold that just give up and return to wow Wow, there are a lot of tips that they didn't really go into details uh, I'm just gonna quickly scroll through some so I can get a better understanding Those were all tips. This is the menu. We got Noah, Uni, Lands, and Wamba. Seems like we've lost Yorin. I think I keep forgetting Yorin's name. And uh, let's see. You can access the expansion pass from here. Adventure support pack. Oh, we haven't seen the, the girl here. Access our characters. We have Noah. Uni. Noah has a lot of attack. He has a lot of healing power. Lance has a lot of. has a high block rate and HP. Here we have another attacker, which is not as good as the main character. Let's see, we can equip accessories. And change our skills. Level 30 and And the system. Uh save amiibo. I always wanted amiibos, but they're always the ones I always wanted were really expensive because they were either out of print or just scalped in general. But I'm gonna end it here for today. Uh there are three save slots. It's good enough. It's good to keep a record. Uh so far. First impressions, pretty dang good. It set up the story really well, or not the story, but like the setting. How we're, um, we have like a lifespan of like 10 years and we essentially live our lives in order to reach the 10 year mark. It's very depressing to be honest, but it's very interesting. And I'm sure that the story is going to be finding a way to change the system. I wonder what term we're on now. We look fairly older than everyone else. I'd say like term 
eight or nine, maybe even term ten. Because like term one seemed like they were like ten years old, and now I could see this being in the late teens, like anywhere from seventeen to twenty. And I feel like we're gonna reach the, the close to the end of our term, and we're probably gonna find a way to somehow change this entire system because well this is really messed up let's look at the world really quick whoa what the heck is that whoa that's and our destination is 300 meters away you see it Eh, we'll do that next time anyways i'll be coming back to this for sure don't know how often i'll be able to play this but until then I will be seeing you next time. See ya!